So, uh, tell me, man, how y'all end up meeting? Michael introduced us. Me and Frank didn't exactly travel in similar circles. Come on, you better take off. Really. Shit, I'm good. I ain't bailing. Whoa. Well, am I detecting some, uh, some sort of, uh, son I never had bullshit here, Mikey, huh? Hey, listen. If you want to replace some father figure, you can do a lot better than this fat snake, all right? This fucker would eat his own kids. Like I said, Franklin, deranged. You better grab a head start. Nice to meet you, homie. Yeah, whatever. Whoa! Looks like we've attracted the attention of their air unit. You got a bogey coming at you, Franklin. I thought I had the easy job. Buddy. Yeah, he's more of a protege. Yeah, what, you gonna teach him to be old before his time? Yeah, to never grow up. That seems like a good kid. I say left, you say right. I say become a doctor. You say become a patient. I say, who is that? Hello, Missy. Wow, Franklin. You never told me that you had a sister. I'm Denise, Franklin's housemate. And aunt, my mother's old dried up ass Shut sister. the fuck up. Yeah, shut the fuck up. Fuck up! Here, darling. Why don't you go get yourself something nice, okay? Oh, thank you. <laughs> is, is it seven dollars? I said something nice, not expensive. You want to be a greedy fucking cow, huh? No. Now get the fuck out of here, all right? You men are all the same. Man, what the fuck you doing here? Here with the boy. The boys. What? I'm fucking new in town. I'm making friends, all right? Now let's party. Look, I had plans on getting some rest until this clown and my aunt came and fucked that up. My nigga, I just came over here to holler at you about the little thing. Man, I said I'm tired, dawg. What fucking thing? I love things. I'm the king of things. I ain't talking to you, homie. Hey, let's go do something about the thing, okay? What thing? I'm talking about the little stress thing, man. Fucking beautiful. Perfect. It's a gangbang. Let's go. Come on. Man, what is this for, man? What is this nigga man, just problem, come man? on. Yo, it's me, man. Hey. We shooting shit up, spraying some motherfuckers. I can drive by with the best of them. Behave yourself, man. Lamar, what's happening? What you and stress set up? We buying weight, homie. Something that'll move us up the food chain, nigga, for real. Not this real in this town, nigga. Particularly where you and stress concern. Man, this is an investment opportunity. You got to speculate to accumulate. Ooh! First rule of business. Hey, since we're out here banging, either you got some dust. Fool wanna get butt naked? <laughs> I'll get whatever it takes me, homeboy. Homie's crazy, man. <laughs> so I've heard. Courier service. Packets to collect. You got the grip? Present and accounted for. <laughs> you like that, huh? Sample? <laughs> now we talking. <laughs> My throat getting numb already. So we good, nigga, right? Well, let's go. How about a taste? No, man, we leaving. I want a taste of the other side of the brick. Now you heard what your boy said, you're leaving. Hey, give me the, give me the back. Whoa. What the fuck? Did we ask for a key or a fucking ounce? Man, that's motherfucking drywall. Hey, we got some motherfucking buyer's remorse out here. Damn, you can't fucking hustle a hustler. Fuck ah. oh, you motherfuckers are dead. Let's move. Oh, They're yeah. ganging up on me. I work done here. and keep our heads down. We ain't gonna lose the cops on these things. Yeah, man, shit, we need to get to land. Come on, 
Climb up here! Damn, man! How we gonna do this? I got an idea, kid. Stay close. Officer, it all started when they didn't have the kilo of cocaine we pre-ordered. Man, I guess that ain't gonna fly. The trouble kids get into. We ain't out of this shit yet. I'm starting to get why Michael might have appealed as a mentor. You need help. <laughs> shit, I'll take whatever I can get. You think we got time to go back to that drywall? Man, I think we ought to lose the heat first. All right, because that drywall looks, you know, high quality. I mean, we could make a fun night out of that brick. Man, fuck you. I think they gone, man. Hey, can you, like, drop me around the way? Hey, this how it worked for you and Michael back in the day? Mm, not quite. No gangs in the Midwest, or if there were, they weren't cool ones. Hey, you guys ever get con? You know, licks like that. Because it seems like every time we go out, more dudes trying to get... Cause it seems like every time we go out, man, dude's trying to get over on us. That's the gang mentality, bro. You're relying on the criminal element being trustworthy. That's pathetic. Yeah, thanks, dawg. So what's the option? You deal with civilians. Liquor stores, gas stations, armored cars, banks, cash depots, easy pots, when you stack them next to a street full of tooled up homeboys. Man, it's always the way it plays out with LD, man. Bunch of g up fools wanting us dead and nothing to show for it. Come man. Man, I love this dude, but damn, I need to roll with some pros, man. What's happening? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, buddy, buddy. Listen, Lamar, he's your friend, right? Has been for years. We'll show him some loyalty, okay? What, you think Michael's gonna be loyal to you? Ha! You can't buy that. You can't find it on the street. I was Michael's best friend, and he let me think he was dead for ten years. You're a cheap gun who he's only just met. Uh, yeah, okay, man. E mm, okay, yeah, well, think about it. Hey, hey man, this is cool just up here. So, look man, I guess we know each other now, right? That we do, bro. I'll see ya. You and Floyd can help, and we'll bring along Michael and his unpaid intern. You okay? All right. Where's the assistant? On his way. Uh, kid idolized us. He gives me the creeps. Yo! Uh, yo, Frankie, we were just talking about you. Ah, oh, nattering. You know how it is. Yeah, whatever, man. So what are we doing here? We're working, amigo. Taking a score. Yeah, done most of the planning, and uh, I think we're gonna literally Make out like bandits on this. Yeah, and Lester told us not to do that job, but we did it anyway. And Lester seems pretty good, man. Would you shut the fuck up, all right? And you, Michael, owe me, all right? So this time, we do things my way. We are sinking a freighter into Los Santos Harbor, all right? Now, Daddy's little helper, you're gonna be on the bridge, all right? You're the lookout. Which part is easy, though? Oh, for fuck, where'd you get the pussy, Mikey? Man, fuck you. Ah, better. I like that. Fuck you. Good. Good. All right, now let's go make some money, ladies, huh? Brilliant. Don't be a dick. Oh, your wish is my commando, master. Let's go, Junior. Stop dragging your heels, kid. We need some transport. I'm coming, man. Oh, we taking my car, are we? I'm dropping you on the port city side of the Miriam Turner overpass, all right? Almost forgot. Here's the rifle with a the thermal scope. Almost forgot? I was kind of sold on, like, a well-organized job, planned out, with Lester's weird eye for details. I got an eye for details, kid. Little details like your brick of blow being drywall. Uh, 
Okay, man, I'm grateful for that, dog. But, but buying cocaine is a whole different thing from sinking a container ship into a harbor. Uh, not really, kid. It's all about what's inside. Cool, so what's the thing, man? I don't know what it is, but I know it's important. You heard of Meriwether? Uh, yeah, maybe. Meriwether Security Consulting, the company our government uses to fight its wars and protect its shady interests all over the planet. They're the army? They're like the army, only they're private, so they cost more. Anyway, they've just been cleared to take government contracts on U.S. soil, and what's one of the first on the list? This container at the port? Exactamundo! So it's gotta be valuable, right? Anyway, it doesn't matter, because your job is not to understand, it's to shoot at people who try to stop us. I'll stop the car in the median here. Get out, find your spot on the side of the bridge, and call Michael. All right, man, whatever. Man, you can say whatever you want about Trevor, but shit, he got it done. Yep, let's hope so. Where's the surrogate child? Who? Uh, the boy! And the stars in his eyes. Not like that. What's not like that? Oh, hey! Hey there, uh, You and him, the old father-son issues? Gives me the fucking creeps. How's the leg rub? Oh, it's excellent! Fuck, you wanna go? No, I'm good, though. Hey, I, I called you boys here to discuss this job that I've been planning. All right, let's do this, you fucks! Sandy Shores Airfield, bro. Sandy Shores? That's quite a distance. What's with this guy? Man, I didn't realize we was going all the way out there either. I've been told your generation are work shy. Repeatedly, but this is the first time I've seen it for myself. You won't leave the city for the biggest take of your life? Man, it's not like that. Well, what is it like, huh? You think the world owes you a living? You want money and respect, but you won't cross the street to get it. That useless millennial shit is more of a middle class thing. Where I'm from, hustling is still hustling. And going halfway across the state is still, uh, going halfway across the state. Yeah, well, Sandy Shores is the global headquarters for TP8, okay? Okay, so we gotta make the trip. TP8? Trevor Phillips Industries. My company. I cannot believe this. The hard-working entrepreneur is getting shit from a guy so lazy he retired in his 30s. And then from this other guy whose sense of entitlement is so strong, he asks, how far we had to travel when he's offered a job he ain't even qualified to do. This is why the country is screwed. There's not enough me's, there's too many you's. Yeah, a country full of you's. That's just what this world needs. Shit would get done. It would be Darwinian. Hey, look, dude, we helping you out. But if you think you'd be better off on your own... No, 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 hey, look, hey, the God! Well, just let's calm down. Okay, fine, fine, I'll go along with it. Listen, Frank, if you want out, I understand. No, 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 I'm good. I can do with a paycheck. That's the spirit! Trevor, you got your company name sprayed all over this chopper. But, uh, everything else about it says military. Yep. I got it from the military base. And there's all this military hardware in the back. Guns and whatnot. Mm-hmm. This thing gets hot, they'll come in handy. Hey, man, so, uh, got the thing. What is it? We'll know what it is when we can run some tests. Well, what it look like? What you think it is? Uh, best guess it was hooked into the rock, maybe on a fault line, so... Could be a seismic suppressor to combat earthquakes and tsunamis, or, no, potentially it's like a fusion reactor running on seawater. Like nuclear? Yeah, the good kind of nuclear. And is this what your bar was after? Yeah, well, for sure. No, we'll be paid, Frankie. We will be well paid. Because, frankly, I'm rich enough to do whatever the fuck I want, and you're poor enough not to ask me any goddamn stupid questions. Now, I mean that as a friend. Namaste.
That's a nice fucking speech about the value of friendship. Oh, of course you must be the creepy one. Not coming from you, please. Whoa, hey, stay in the car there, homeboy. I'll deal with you later. Yeah, fuck you too. Hey man, you know how hard it was to drive small enough to stay with these fools? Let's have a real race. Devin's lonely lawyer says go to Hayes Auto in South LS, so that's where I'll be waiting. We'll see about that. I vote we indulge his childish need to play. Besides, it's his head on the block if they get scratched. If I can keep this lead, I'll be able to get some alone time with Devin's lady friend. Hey, if it's about the girl, I saw her first. Don't get too creepy, all right? She's a professional woman who's doing her job. And leave it at that. No sexual harassment in the workplace, T. Not on my watch. I'm serious. Both of you. Back off her. Dog, come on, man. You got the fucking paper? Absolutely. Look, you finish the job, you get the paper. But the order was for five cars. If I'm not mistaken, that's only two. Just give me the fucking money now. Oh, I'm so scared. I really, really am. But you know what? I'm a payment on completion, a work type of guy. You don't like the job? Take a fucking walk. Hey, come on, man. Hold on. So what's next, man? Well, it's the Z-type. Chad Mulligan. Lay it on him, kid. Mulligan's a record producer. He's going through a messy divorce. He's hiding his valuable assets, including the car, so that makes it complicated. He'll clock any ground surveillance we run. All we've got to go on is that the car's in a lockup in Howick. So we just go house to house? Not quite. We have access to an LSPD helicopter. The computer on board can ID pedestrians from a chip in their driver's license. Find Mulligan and Howick, follow him to the lockup, someone on the ground collects the car. All right, so who does what? You're not needed for this job. Phillips, you're in the chopper. Clinton, you're on the ground. Put up your hands and stand where I can see you. All right, you got me, homie. All right. You know how to work that face recognition shit already? Well, figure it out. Why don't we see if this thing picks up my man on the ground?
rear side of the garage. On my left, there's a man in a car. This better be him. This better be the guy. Hey, that's the motherfucker. Thank you, Trevor Fitt. I know you think this car might be worth something, but... Suspect down! Mine work, ground unit! Hey, I'm delivering the ride to Los Santos International. Hey, is the lady gonna be there? Or just a dick who ain't paying us till we get all the cars? Shit, I think they both gonna be there, dog. Devin and Molly. Say hello from me to Molly. Man, I ain't hitting on nobody for you, man. Least of all, her. Come on, why not? It's about time I settled down. Shit, man, you need like a lion tamer or some shit. This girl, man, she got balls, dog, but she needs some serious stones to handle your ass. Just say hello. <laughs> man, I ain't gonna be a part of that. After everything I've done for you, ah, you are just like Michael. It's good to hang out with you, kid. Man, you too. Only less of the kid, please. So you're not looking for a father figure? Man, if I was looking for a father figure, I'd like to think I'd find a couple better candidates than you and Michael. You a pair of lunatics. I, I mean, I'm bad. But you two? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> well, family is important, though. How you been, kid? Fine. But enough with the kid. It's kind of annoying. Sorry, kid. I, got... <laughs> I mean, sorry. It just... I just, you're a good kid! You got potential. I see it. Mikey obviously saw it the moment he met you, but let's be honest. You need a real guide through life, because that fits yours. Who you choose to learn from. Sure, dog. Thanks for the advice. 